Hey guys, it's your girl, Miss Pink Sexy 101, but you can just call me Pink. I am back with another haul. Um, today was a holiday, it was a Jewish holiday today. I think it's Rosh Hashanah today. Um, it's Jewish New Year, so it's either Yom Kippur or Rosh Hashanah. I think it's Rosh Hashanah. Um, so everything was closed, schools, etc., etc. It was closed today. And a couple of my favorite stores were closed today. Um, I went out to Jamaica Avenue, which is like our mecca for shopping in Queens. And um, yeah, I went out there to, to do a little shopping since I was off. And um, some people, you know, families away. So it's just me and my girlfriend today. And um, she had some things to do. So I took a trip out there and... Um, picked up a few things but um, I have some things that I wanted to talk about first that I didn't get on this haul today that I got on a previous shopping trip that I don't think I talked about I think I took pictures of it and put it on my blog but I don't think that I um, that I did a um, vlog about it where is my little sleep mask yeah, I got some really, really cool things. They have eclairs. They have opened up a... Where is it? There it is. They've opened up eclairs on Jamaica Avenue. And you cannot tell me how exciting that is for me. Okay, I went to Claire's, And of course, they always have a Hello Kitty section. And we all know Miss Pink loves her some Hello Kitty. Um, Hello Kitty sleep mask. Hello Kitty sleep mask. <laughs> I also uh, got a Hello Kitty necklace that, um, oh, I gotta show you my new um, organizer that I've got for my jewelry because I'm slowly but surely trying to redecorate my entire room here. Um, I've got to replace my blinds, I've got to clean up some things and make some adjustments as far as storage is concerned but take a look at these awesome elf brushes they've got these rhinestone accents I haven't even bothered to open it because it's so pretty I don't want to use it once I'm finished redecorating I'm going to redo my makeup corner and display these I'm just gonna display them I'm so not going to use them because they're just too pretty to use look at that it's a foundation brush a, f a blush brush like a full face powder brush and an eyeshadow brush three dollars I got it in the three for twelve I'm sorry <laughs> four dollars I got it in the three for twelve um, wall at rocks I love that store that store oh my gosh that's always my first stop every time I go down to Jamaica Avenue and the girl behind the counter had told me that they were soon going to be having a sale on their NYX products half price and the only thing is their NYX products are always so expensive and I'm just waiting for this half price off sale that she said that they're going to be having because I am going to rack up and of course I'm gonna bring it to you guys I might even film while I'm shopping who knows but this awesome and I know I'm mad late, but the EOS lip balm, you know, it wasn't out here yet in the Color Folk neighborhood. So, you know, your girl Miss Pink got her the strawberry one and I absolutely love it. This stuff is so moisturizing and it smells so good. My girlfriend, every time she comes over to give me a kiss, she's like, you smell like candy. Love it. <laughs> so, yeah. So, um, like I said, you know, they always have the three for 12. I don't even remember what the heck else I ended up getting from Elf. I don't remember. I got the brushes. I got this awesome glossy gloss in a muted mauve. This stuff, I'm actually wearing it right now. Very shiny. I have only had to apply it one time and it's still shiny. It's a beautiful, like... I don't know. I don't even know what kind of color to call it. It's like a, a nude brown with like a, a bluish kind of tint to I don't even know what to call it. But all I know is it's amazing and it's my new favorite and it's permanent inside of my makeup bag now. It has become one of the permanent staples in the makeup bag. So um, that's where it stays. 
I also got the uh, NYX Narcissus. There we go, the NYX Narcissus. And it's this very, very light pink. Um, I'm not sure about it yet. I've used it once. I've had to, you know, layer it with a few other things. I don't know. I'm on the fence with it right now. I'm very, very on the fence with it right now. We'll see how uh, it goes. But what I did pick up was uh, the new L'Oreal Caress lipstick. And I've got this one in pink vinyl. I was really, really, because, you know, like I said before in my previous videos, I'm trying to get back into the pinks and see how they work with my skin tone because I love pink so much. But, you know, I can never find the right pink to wear on my lips because I have pigmented lips. But as you can see, that EOS lip balm has worked to exfoliate a lot of the dryness and keep my lips at least uh, a shade lighter. I'm not saying it's going to lighten everyone's lips. It's not like bleach or anything like that. But a lot of the dryness has peeled off. And plus with my exfoliating that I do to it all the time, it's also served to lighten it a little bit. But this pink vinyl color is awesome. Look at this. Look at, look at that color. That is hot pink. And I love it. And it goes on so sheer. It goes on amazingly sheer. And um, a little pink gloss on top. I put my NYX gloss right on top of there. A little bit of a purple pencil. Beautiful. So, those are the things that I had gotten from that haul the other day. I'm going to put all that stuff back because I hate it when I do these videos and everything is all over the place when I'm done. So, today's haul um, is going to be a mixture of a little bit of makeup and mostly clothes and the baddest pair of shoes that I'm going to save for last because those oh my god honey oh my god so um I had gotten the Ruby Kisses 3D face creator and it was it's a concealer and I was going to be using it for contouring but when I did uh put it on I mean it's a great product it's awesome it doesn't make you look ashy or anything like that um, I was going to put it on and try to use it for contouring, but I noticed that it's a little too light to contour for my skin. Um, it actually works as a really great concealer. Under eyes, blemishes, etc., etc., it works really, really well. As you can see, I've been using it the little <laughs> fingerprints. So um, I went to go get a darker one. As you can see, it's totally new. I, I have to peel the, the tape off to get it open. Um, so I went and I got a darker one because I'm really trying to experiment with contouring. Shh, don't tell my girlfriend she hates contouring. She calls the girls who, you know, she calls them contour whores <laughs> or gazelles. <laughs> but um, I'm really trying to get into, well, right now I'm trying to get into this packaging. That's the only thing I don't like about it is the packaging is so difficult to get into when you first get it. So I've got the darker color this is level 16 the level that I had that matched me was level 12 so I got it in level 16 which is a much darker uh, concealer and I'm hoping that I'll be able to use this to contour my um, cheekbones and of course right down my nose to try to get my nose to you know, look a, just a little bit smaller. I, I'm very proud of my nose. It's a family trait. You know, it's not something that I hate or anything like that. It's just, I got a big nose. <laughs> so, um, that, we'll see how it works with that one. And I did get, I saw one of the girls, I think it was, oh my gosh, African Goddess. Is that her name? African Export. That's her name. I think it was either her or Destiny Godly. It might have been Destiny Godly, though, who um, spoke about the Black Radiance um, blushes. And this one is in Blackberry. And it is absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Gorgeous. It's like swirls of purple and gold and like, you know, a little bit of pink in there. And when you swirl it all together, it's this amazing glow absolutely beautiful 
I got it for five bucks. That's going in the collection. All right, and of course, my staple, Neutrogena makeup remover towelettes. I had to refill my blue box. So those go over there with the boom. Don't you just love deodorant crust? <laughs> so then um, I bought a few items of clothing. Um, you know, we've got some, some cheapy, cheapy things. So usually I wear in the house, I like to wear, you know, little house dresses in the house. So I've got this one and it's absolutely adorable. It's like a teal kind of color it was I think it was like $9.99 yeah they were $9.99 they were on those outside um racks so it's got like this uh graduated hemline it starts off short in the front and gets longer in the back so these are things that I just like to wear in the house I'm actually wearing a pretty pink one now as you can see pretty pretty pink one so I got it in like this teal color because my girlfriend loves like bluish colors. And then I just got it in a gray as well. And then I got this awesomely sexy black see-through. This is like the new thing now. I guess for fall is the uh, sheer, the sheer tops, the sheer button downs. So I got one of these and I think it's awesome. And how much was it? It was $19.99. It was 20 bucks. You know, it's cute. I love it. I've got some really nice uh, seven jeans that are like a velour material that these will go really nice with. So I've got those. And then I went into strawberries. A lot of us know about strawberries. Oh, this was from a store called Weekend. Weekend has like club clothes. You know, like really quick things, quick cheapy cheapy things that you want to buy when you want to go clubbing. So we got stuff like that. And um, then I went into strawberries, and um, I went into strawberries with the intention of going into the suit in the shoe section because usually strawberries has a lot of uh, Steve Madden shoes sometimes, really really cute things. But they really didn't have anything in the shoe section, so I ran around to the lingerie section, and they had these. Uh, Marilyn Monroe Intimates. How cute is that? Marilyn Monroe has a lingerie line. And originally they're supposed to be sold for $36. But um, at Strawberries they were selling them for $9.99. So you know your girl racked up. So for the price of one, I got three. You know? One, two. Yeah, I bought three. So they're really cute, like cheetah prints very lacy at the bottom really really cute girly very feminine they've got adjustable straps which I like because I'm a little heavy on the top so these should be really really cute and pretty so I got this one in like this black and white cheetah then I got like the brown cheetah is the same kind of oh no it's not the same kind of design it's a little bit different of a design at the top of this one um same kind of lacing at the bottom really cute and then of course because you know my name wouldn't be miss pink if i didn't get something that had pink in it so i've got this one it's just kind of like a snake skin not as much lace at the bottom but um you know very cute and pink so I got that. And now for the piece de resistance because I pass by these shoes in the window of Rainbow and every time I pass by them I just go, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Don't go away. I'm gonna get you. And today I got them. Oh my gosh. Cheetah print, leopard print, red with spikes all over them. Platform heel and this awesome gold detailing around here. Absolutely gorgeous. OMG. 
<laughs> I don't even know what to say. <laughs> There's nothing to say. Just enjoy. That's it. There's nothing else to say about it. Oh my gosh. I think, to be honest with you, I don't even think I'm going to wear these. I'm going to wait. And I'm going to use this as my focal point for my birthday. My birthday is in January. And this is what? September, October, November, December, January. My birthday is in four months. So I'm going to keep these. I'm going to put these shoes away. And I'm going to break them out in January for my birthday. God help us. <laughs> and the shoes were actually... These were... I think this was like the most expensive thing I bought all day. $44.99. 45 bucks for them. But they're gorgeous. I don't care. I mean, believe you me, I've spent a lot more than $45 on a pair of shoes. But those, right, Chia? To die for. So, um, here is a little look at what I did with my jewelry. I'm gonna try to switch this stupid thing around. I don't think it's gonna let me do it. But I was able to, um, I purchased like a cheapy cheapy shower caddy from our 99 cent store. And um, those are those awesome command hooks uh, that you see on TV with the peel away uh, back, the sticky back, on, you know, peel away sticky thing on the back. And I was able to uh, put my jewelry, finally display my jewelry. Um, I had everything in this tiny little box and it was so hard and I wasn't able to wear everything or see everything. So now um, I can see everything. I can display my sunglasses and you know my little rings and things like that and all of my hoop earrings which are awesome and my necklaces. And there's my kitty. Wait, where's my kitty? There's my kitty. So um, that is what I purchased today which I think is absolutely awesome um, for now. Um, I'm gonna get a, a really nice jewelry caddy um, once we move out of here and get our own uh, place. But for now, it was 10 bucks at the 99 cent store and uh, it works. <laughs> so now that little black box, oh my God, I'm showing you guys my terribly dirty room. Um, so now that little black box is holding my nail polishes. Um, which the collection for that is starting to get a little crazy too. So I don't know. I might need to get one of those wall things very soon. Or just a bigger, that's just a bigger caddy. Who knows? We'll see how it goes. But, um, that is it for my haul guys. And, um, hopefully I'll be coming back to you with some reviews of the lipsticks I bought and the 3D face creator that darker, um, concealer that I bought to contour um hopefully I'll be doing some tutorials maybe I'll show how I use it and um we'll take some pictures maybe with those shoes on so you guys can see what the shoes look like on my feet hmm. all right guys this is your girl miss pink sexy 101 signing off please feel free to rate comment subscribe hit that little button Come on, you know you want to. Signing off, guys. Bye.